Ever since the original Nerf bow and arrow came out in 1991, geez, that's more than three decades ago, soft foam archery became an instant hit in the then very primitive foam flinging community. We had many exciting offerings come out through the years, such as the big bad bow and all the variations that bow came in. We had the blazing bow. Then we had some pseudo realistic style archery bows that came out, such as the dude perfect line. And then the zing bows started popping up. One of the latest hottest new products that follows that same design and build of the Zingbo is the Quick Switch Power Bow from Hogwild Toys. This bow launcher specializes in having two power modes by use of two different bow strings. We're going to totally take this outside and play with it. I have a special guest with me today. Miss Notnuff is going to help me test these bows out. We're going to do a 50 foot range test with the green bow string and then we're going to do a 100 foot range test with the red string and then we're going to give our lasting thoughts in the end. Let's get into it. A different kind of product today we got the hog wild power switch bow i got a special guest with me today you know it it's Ms. not enough. we're gonna be testing this bow this bow's main characteristic is the fact that it does come with two power systems as far as strings they're calling the green one rapid release so it's for more of a quick gameplay when you just need to pull and shoot quickly the red one that you see here around my neck is the ultimate is what they call it this is what you put on to get those long range shots we got a little mini range tested here with my 400 pound crossbow target these arrows will be bouncing off of it but it'll be a good way to get a standard length acquisition we're going to shoot with the green string at the 50 yard mark and then we're going to be shooting with the red strings at the 100 yard mark let's get these shots down range guys so much fun shout out to Ms. not enough for coming out there with me and helping me test these but guys this is extremely fun as far as the interchangeability of the cords it's very simple you basically just pop it this way and then you slide it out just like that when you want to slide it back on you just pop it like that as far as removing the string from this section you just twist these in that direction and it allows the string to come out of the front it's that simple. As far as which string to use, it depends on your comfort level. If you like a little bit less of a tension, but you still like some decent distance, I found that the green cords are actually sufficient. And if you want that extra distance, you literally just have to pull back the arrow just a little bit. Now I do recommend wearing some eye protection. I'm pretty sure these things are tested to maximum pull, but you just never know. And it's better to protect your eyes because you only get one set. The red string clearly and obviously has a little bit more tension, but I found it pretty easier to pull. Even Miss Not Enough eventually did gain 
maintain the muscle memory necessary to pull the red string back in a symmetrical way to let the arrow loose in a straight line. Overall, I highly recommend this product. I'm a big fan of Zingbos, but I'm still gonna give you my honest opinion on this product. The grip is fully symmetrical, therefore it is 100% ambidextrous. It can be used for left-hand archers or it can be used for right-hand archers. As you were able to see in our live testing, all you have to do is literally just knock your arrow with these two little notches on each string and then you loose it, just like that. It's pretty simple. This is a lot of fun, guys. Me and Miss Latinov at one point got carried away. We forgot all the video and the cameras were rolling and we just kept playing because we liked it so much. This is a great alternative to real archery in case you just don't have the proper bags to shoot at and you just want to put up a makeshift target. Any typical hardboard or plywood will work. Even some cardboard, I would assume. Very safe arrows. I would imagine they probably can sting a human if hit at close enough range, but they'd be totally safe for an all-out Nerf archery war. I believe these are going right now for $29.99. They are sold at Target. Target does have periodical sales on most of their toy products, so there's only a matter of time before this does go on sale, but I still think that $29.99 is a reasonable price for a product like this. It brings so much value to the table. Interchangeable power packages, three arrows that do whistle. They're a lot of fun to shoot as you were able to see in the video. Overall, I do recommend this one. If you did enjoy this review, I know you're gonna like this one for sure. Stay arrow flinging, bump fam.